Hey friends, Tendi here. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome and thank you for stopping by. In this video, I'm going to show you seven cleaning hacks that will not only make your cleaning easy and fast, but to make your space look beautiful and neat and also save you some dollars as well. These cleaning tips are in no particular order, but number four is one of my best hacks. It has been a lifesaver for me and also for many people here. Be sure to stick to the end for a surprise bonus life hack. Let's do this. Number one, save your knees by using the dollar store garden knee pad the next time you go to the dollar store grab the knee pad from the garden section use it as knee support when cleaning in the kitchen bathroom or all over the house number two clean your shower or bathtub faster grab a dish one from the dollar store or walmart and put a cleaning product of your choice i like using a combination of blue dawn soap and vinegar it's great for soap scum and hard water stains as well while taking a bath go ahead and clean the bathtub or shower and rinse out the product this will save you time and you get this dreaded chore done fast and easy Number 3 Cookware Organizer Hack Use this lid or pen cookware organizer to store foil paper. Simply stack your foil paper or cling wrap on top of each other. Look how neat it is. So much better than what it was before. If you are getting any value from this video, may you hit the like button and also share share the video so that it can reach many people this will help the channel to grow as well thank you so much for your support number four under faucet cleaning this is the lifesaver hack i promise to show you friends somehow this area is missed when cleaning because it's always facing down most faucet head twists off from the hose and you can still use the water from the faucet when cleaning if it doesn't unscrew, just go ahead and put the vinegar in a ziplock bag, place the faucet head base in there and tie with a rubber band. For the faucet head that can be unscrewed, here's what you want to do. Put 2 tablespoons of vinegar in a bowl, just enough to cover the base of the faucet. Place the faucet head in the bowl and let it dwell for about 2 hours so as to soften all the hard water deposits and any dirt build up. Clean with dish soap and a cleaning brush and rinse thoroughly. That's it, the faucet head is all clean. Look at the before and after, day and night difference. This will save someone's life. Please do share with your family and friends. Number five, it's all about the magic erasers. Do not use the whole magic eraser when cleaning. Instead, what you wanna do is to cut in half or threes or even in four, depending on what you want to use them for. That way you will not run out of the magic erasers quickly and this will save you some dollars my friend. Number 6 Broom Hack for Cleaning Baseboards Clean your baseboards fast and easy by using a broom and microfiber towel. This trick will save your back when cleaning baseboards. First things first, if your baseboards are dusty like mine here, use a dry microfiber towel or a long Swiffer duster to dust or vacuum with a dust attachment. Next, get a bucket with warm water and put few drops of Dawn soap or spray Dawn power wash like I'm doing here. Grab your wet microfiber towel and wrap it around the broom like this. I'm using small scrunchies. You can also use rubber bands. Start cleaning from top to bottom and pay attention to any tight areas. On to number 7. Use a butter knife to remove debris in between the stove and cabinets. This area hides a lot of dirt. So what you want to do is to place the butter knife inside the towel and use it to clean in between the gaps. Here's another idea. You can also buy these counter gap covers and this will solve the problem as well. I'll put the link in the description box on where you can find them. So this one is a bonus hack. If you have kids in the house, this is for you my friend. Get the pool noodle from Walmart or the dollar store 
Cut a piece and place it on the door where kids cannot reach. No more banging doors or kids numbing the door on their little fingers. Which cleaning hack was your favorite? Let's chat in the comments below. Also feel free to share some of your favorite cleaning hacks and tricks that you use or that you have used before. I will pick some and share on the next cleaning hacks videos. My job is done here. You can try these cleaning tips or hacks at home. See you on the next one. Bye.